Okay, um, this is by way of another basic instruction video just to give you guys a little bit of incentive to uh, get on your steels and have a go. Uh, it's not intended for people that can play. The reason I'm a bit reluctant to, to do this sort of thing is I don't understand music myself. Um, Basil Hendricks says I know enough about theory not to let it interfere with my playing. So uh, <laughs> you figure that for yourself. But what I'm going to show you, right, I think the best thing to get you started is a 12 bar sequence. Now you'll find a 12 bar sequence on band in the box. Very simple, just an ordinary 12 bar. Now it's going to be in C, which you guys will know if you put your pedals down on the third fret, you've got your C, right? But I ain't going to play it that way. I'm going to drop down two frets and I'm going to lower my E's. So I'm going to get that sort of jazzy six sound. There's another way of getting that sound. Um, I can I can get it on the third fret by lowering the ninth. But I prefer the lower the E's one. Right? That's a good sound. Now that's your first chord of this 12 bar that we're going to play, right? Now the second chord, all you're going to do is put your two pedals in and you're going to slide it up to there, right? Which is your 6th fret. So you've gone from the 1st fret with just the E's lowered and you're hitting strings 5, 6 and 8 and you're going to take those same strings and you're going up to the 6th fret and put the pedals in. Both those pedals, right? Now that's the second chord I'm going to show you. Then back to that C6. Now the last chord in this sequence, because it's a three chord bash, very simple. You're going to come up to the third fret. You're going to hit 5, 6 and 9. But you're going to hit them go back for string four like that and there you have your 12 bar now what I'm going to do is play the band in the box and play along with it and show you variations of things that you can do with that and you'll get so much satisfaction out of playing this that you'll play it for hours well at least I did anyway um, I'll, I'll give you the band in, band in the box 12 bar it's called David's 12 Bar Blues Jam I've got up here on my band in the box and we'll see how she goes. <laughs> into those chords then you can go you can play the ordinary C as well little phrases are within those chords all I'm doing there is going up one fret put the pedals in and sliding into that seventh so 
there you have just with the ears lowered go up one fret put the pedals down gives you that lovely rich seventh take the whole chord up to the sixth fret you've got the second move take it back down take your pedals off but keep your ears lowered then the last move back up to the, the C proper if you want now you can mix and match you can play your C there that's the second chord that I've shown you two pedals down E's lowered so that's open There you go, um, that's pretty much all there is in a 12 bar in C, um, I'm sure you'll mess with it and get it better than I can play it, but it takes a little time, and once you get used to playing those six sounds, uh, you get that jazzy thing in your head, you, you really want to play that, it's, uh, and the, the other thing is it's the discipline of playing to tempo, you can sit there forever trying to think about it, but if you're playing it to the band in a box, and that tempo's going, you've got to keep with it. So um, give it a try anyway, you guys, and, and good luck. I guess that's, uh, that's it for now.